Hi guys, Gunchin Pei and welcome back to my legendary playthrough of Skyrim on the Xbox 360. In the last episode we took out one of the targets for the Dark Brotherhood which was this guy, the Runinus Papius. And we're currently on our way to find the Iron Bind Barrow, which is hopefully somewhere around where the marker is. Yeah, so far so good. And um, we seem to be able to kick ass at the moment as well, which I'm quite happy about. Um, we managed to take out a couple of wolves as well, without too much problem. A couple of mud crabs finally got revenge on mud crabs. kind of circle thing you can see on my compass right now there's a castle over there a wolf <laughs> fox next to me for company now the good thing about this mission and I am buying Barrow is that you'd have to take it out on your own you actually get quite a lot of help um, from a group of mercenaries that are kind of camped outside being a bit wussy about the whole thing but you know they do help you out quite a bit just get cash in clean up after them Something's shown up on the compass, but I don't see it. That's what I didn't need. These are a lot easier to deal with now. Oh, this is so much fun now. Finally I can start killing things, I don't have to keep running away like a cat. Now... Friendly fox. In that case. Thing is, there is. Sleep. Oh, and a kill cam. <laughs> Sweet. Thank you. So you can cave. Place I'm looking for it.
friend. Oh no, maybe not. Now, when I'm not aiming is when I seem to do really well. So yeah, really cool. I'm finally starting to... I'm kind of confused as to what... Hmm. Yeah, this looks more. And uh, let's go up here. Hopefully, we should find two mercenaries. One's an Argonian. Uh, I am buying Byron. In there. We must gather our strength. Who knows what's inside? Treasure, that's what. Get off your scaly rump and let's go. Hush, Salma. We aren't alone. Hello. So yeah, these are the we'll see mercenaries. Ugh, we should be inside loading up on treasure. Worry scales here thinks we should wait. Worry scales. Don't get any ideas either. We were here first. Uh what the Gold? Silver? Gems, maybe? Only one way to find out. What's going on? I don't care what Beam says. It's high time we get in there and find our fortune. Not without us, you aren't. I'm sure there's enough for everyone, after all. Come on, Beamja. We're going. Beamja. <laughs> Jar Jar Binks is tired of debating it. I admit, there is strength in numbers. Perhaps between us. All right, let's get this done. Okay, so the basic game plan now is to let these two, Bungle and Zippy, uh, clear out all the bad guys for them. And you just hang back and loot the bodies. Mine, mine this. Get on with some fighting as you can hear. Careful not to hit them because you will <sighs> time your shots. I don't think anything. I'm loving this new one. It's really helped by my uh, 
my fortified attribute. Being 275. Maximum potion. We'll take a maximum potion and we need to take that. This is it. We found Gathric's tomb. Weapon. Well, there must be a way through. Look around. Right, so we need to get through this door. See how we see. No, no, you really have to do I me. Mean, I don't understand why. That's done it. Let's get in there. Go guys. I'm a careful hex as a pressure. team. Be careful because no, this isn't going too well. Four. <laughs> it's better than nothing, I guess.
apuramos a hacer. Yes, it's through here. There he goes. Major illusion. Don't rush ahead. Track I ever saw one. This is it. Gathrick awaits us. What are you on about? Let's just get the treasure here and go. Come on, guys. Big guy's down anyway. Dude. I what? should thank you. I knew the girl wouldn't be strong enough to help me kill Gathric alone. There's just one more thing I need from you. To fully absorb Gaithric's power, I require a blood sacrifice. Your blood should be good enough. This will go easier for us both if you don't bother fighting back. Oh, this is what we need, a double clean. Need something. Whoa. Everyone, 
cross. The Beamja. Beamja, keep my daughter safe and you'll earn both your freedom and that damned book you want to but by the divines, if any harm comes to her, I'll make sure everyone I do business with will hear about what you did in Black Marsh. Hmm. Warlord Gath. Black soul gems. Nice. Those hold um, human souls, so every time you kill a bandit, uh, the soul will go into them. Glass bells, ton of gold. Ooh. Now this is what we're here for: the steel battle axe of fiery soul. And the reason. So when we disenchant it, we have a uh, enchantment which basically, uh, if the target dies within five seconds, we'll get a soul, which is brilliant. But it also uh, do fire damage for ten points, which is pretty brilliant. Fade become. So yeah guys, I'm gonna call this episode here, I don't see it. Now the only bad thing is, I am in tank mode and weighted down to the hill but I don't really. Pretty decent loot on board. So what I'm gonna do, um, I'm gonna make my way out of here and I'll catch you guys probably of call is it's Windhelm right guys um, I'll catch you outside Windhelm on the next episode and um, I'm sorry this episode has a bit, been a bit longer than normal but I can't really um, stop it in the middle of um, these dungeon raids hope you find it useful and like I say I am I am buying Barrow is a brilliant place to be because hopefully now in the next episode um, we can enchant our ebony bow to become a soul trapping and fire dealing uh, death machine alright guys as always it's been a pleasure thanks for watching take care and peace